By default, it is only possible to deploy code in your Puppet Enterprise system from the command line. However, if in your organization you have a reason for console-only users who do not have command line access to deploy code, there is a workaround. First, you'll need to install the support task module from the Forge. It is a supported and maintained module, and you'll need to deploy that and have that available on your the Puppet Enterprise system. Secondly, you'll need to have a token generated and in place in the default location. Um, this must have access to run tasks, and you will need an authorized person to first create that token. Um, instructions on how to install modules and generate that token will be in the link in links in the description. So assuming you have your token generated and the support task module installed, you're going to want to go to your console. In the console, under orchestration, you're going to want to go to tasks. Run task, select the environment that support tasks module is in, then select the code deploy task. Its number is ST0298 run code deploy. This task has one required parameter, either the name of the environment you want to deploy or the word all, if all environments are to be deployed. You're gonna to wanna to select a target type. You should only run this task against your primary server um, where you would normally do a code deploy. It won't do any harm if you run it against the other types of server, it just won't work, it'll error out. So we'll run task and that task will run and give you an output of what happened. So you can see it has succeeded. It has the debug level uh, output. If anything went wrong, you would see it here. In this instance, all uh, environments deployed successfully. Thank you.